Hey guys, and in today's video, I'll be reviewing my Spirit Halloween 2012 Damien. So let's get straight into it. So this guy was sold back as online only at, in Spirit Halloween's website in 2012. Sadly, he wasn't available in stores, which he should have. He would have been dope, but he wasn't. Only um, the Howler was in that year. But um, yeah, he was available as online only. I believe for $129.99, he could have been that price or maybe $119.99, around there. But that was a steal back then. However, good news, um, Fraser Hill Farm will be returning a newer version of Damien and the Howler for this year. What I mean a uh, newer version is they're updated in a way. They no longer have a plastic rising mech, plastic bases, plastic... Um, base supports or anything like where the hands are they no longer have that anymore everything the the base is metal the rising mech is completely different um it's completely updated for the good which is amazing and i really do need a new version of damien and the howler because both of mine are currently dead like my howler is completely dead like he still moves his mouth his eyes light up his head turns and he makes sound but he doesn't um, rise, nor he doesn't have a uh, head tilting movement anymore. Uh, for Damien, he still works. However, I had to swap rising mechs. So Damien is currently using my Howler's rising mech. Reason being, so I bought my Damien from OfferUp back in 2018 for $50. He fully worked. But once I got him home, a gear completely splits for the rising mech and he broke there. So then I sacrificed my Howler's Rising Mech, which still worked. However, it still has issues here and there because um, when he first rises, he rises, but then he'll stop and then he'll go back down and then he's supposed to rise up again, but he doesn't, he just stays there. So that's a problem there. So I sacrificed my Howler um, and I use his Rising Mech for him. So now the Howler has Damien's Rising Mech, which doesn't work, but you know, at least Damien still moves somewhat. It's not, it's, this rising mech is also defective as what I just said, but it still does something. So that being said, I need a new, I need a new version of Damien and the Howler ASAP because I love these two guys. I have the newer version of Demonica that Spirit brought back for the 2023 uh, season. And yeah, I really do need a new version of these guys. But other than that, Let's go back to this particular Damien. Um, my Damien, he he works great. His head still tilts, his head still turns, eyes light up red, his audio still works great. He rises up sometimes, like he'll rise up, but then the second time that he's supposed to rise, he doesn't. So that's that small issue. So I have to be forcing him up. I have to be I have to help him a bit. But sometimes he does rise for a second time. Sometimes. Very rare. But other than that, his audio is loud. He's He also has a timer, which is something that the newer models will not have in, in techie props. Is they remove the whole timer thing, sadly. So these guys won't go off immediately, nor they won't go off like every a minute and a half. They'll go off if, they're, if they sense any sound or movement. But uh, yeah or if you have him on the step head. But, um, yeah. So, this is his detail on his face. He has blood, cuts, has a big chunk there. They did an amazing job. The detailing is amazing on this guy. I'm assuming the, 20, the 2024 model, the newer one, I did see a video of him and he looks pretty much the same. The blood might differ, like in certain spots, but he looks exactly the same in his face and everything. Um, they did a good job there. Setup wise, typical techie, very easy, straightforward, nothing crazy. And yeah, that's all I have to say about him. I don't have his arm supports connected to the base just to make my life easier um, to do these videos because I want to get them done. But regardless, they're very fragile. They tend to break very easily. My 2011 Demonica, no, 2010, De my 2010 Demonica her arm supports broke twice. The same one I fixed broke twice. And yeah, it's on its last stand at this point. 
But yeah, these arm supports right here are very fragile. They're not the best. They're not the best at all. I, I really don't like them and I'm so glad now they're like metal and stuff. But that's all I have to say. And he does come with a try me button right here. That's like a little try me button, the red one. He does come with that, which is a little cool thing. But yeah, now I'm gonna plug him in. He's gonna go off immediately because this model has a timer. So he's gonna go off immediately. So it's weird. So he does rise up for the first time, but not fully. He still has he still struggles to fully rise all the way up. So he does rise. It's just it's very weird. Very, very weird. There's some it has to be something with the tracks that's causing it. Something probably broke there. But yeah, that's how my that's how my howler has always been. Ever since I got him, like what, 2017 or something? He's always he's always had that issue with his rising mech. It's weird. I don't know what to, how to explain it, but I'm gonna activate him one more time. He's rising. Let me help it out more. I love the face. So that does it for this video. I hope you guys really um, enjoyed this video a lot. I can't wait for Fraser Hill Farm to officially release Damien and the Howler. Um, I know many people are going to be buying them the moment they the moment they're available, and I really do recommend the Howler, um, Damien, and well both regardless. I love them a lot. Um, this guy, the older model, is very rare to find. He tends to pop up on eBay here and there. Um, Sometimes fully working, sometimes half working here and there. But yeah, I really do recommend them. If you find the OG fully working, and then good for you. Buy him. Um, sometimes the OG models are always better than the newer ones. Just because they probably look better in detailing. Um, their quality may not be the best, but their looks might be better. But yeah. But, you know. That's all I have to say about this guy. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more.